Polishing and grinding are important tasks in manufacturing. The current approach is to have human workers manually do the job, which is time-consuming, expensive, and potentially dangerous. Here we propose a robotic solution for automatic polishing to improve efficiency, safety, and flexibility of the task. The system follows the state transition graph to perform measurement, polishing, and final examination. The workflow is illustrated on a wild bead removal task in the interior of a workpiece. First, the robot performs visual alignment to locate the target workpiece. Then the robot generates a pass for wild bead scanning and uses a laser scanner to measure the wild bead. Once the scanned result is obtained, the robot plans a polishing trajectory and then executes the polishing trajectory through real-time motion control. As a last step, the robot will take another laser scan of the interior of the workpiece to evaluate the polishing performance. The robot motion planning problem is challenging. We need to deal with not only the collision avoidance constraint between the robot and workpiece, but also the task constraint, which requires that the end effector to maintain contact with the wild bead for polishing. Existing motion planning methods either fail to consider these two constraints simultaneously or cannot generate desired trajectories in real time. We propose a novel motion planning algorithm using iterative convex optimization that can successfully handle both the collision avoidance constraint and the task constraint. Most importantly, the algorithm is suitable for real-time computation as it takes only 10 seconds to find a feasible solution shown in the animation. For real-time motion control, we need to address different objectives. The trajectory tracking for task performance, the compliance control for quality, and the collision avoidance for safety. How to address these objectives simultaneously is the main challenge in the controller design. A decomposition framework is proposed based on the global task coordination framework. As shown in the figure, in the normal direction of the workpiece surface, we design a force compliance controller to control the polishing quality. In the tendential direction and the binormal direction, we design a tracking controller and a safety controller respectively. These controllers are seamlessly integrated into the system and successfully addressed the three control objectives. This project is a collaboration between CMU, Siemens, and Iskawa. We anticipate that we will apply this technology to real shop floors in the near future.